Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get this makeup look. It's a very simple, but still <laughs> very simple, really. <laughs> it's kind of like a goldish, brownish feel. And um, we've got lashes, we've got some wing, and this glossy lip. So I'm going to show you how to get this look. And you can get all of these products off of Zando. Um, I'm going to link it down below so you can have a look. And yeah, I'm going to be using Maybelline. Uh, Flormar, Rimmel London and Yardy London products. So yeah, let's just get straight into the video So to start off we're gonna be priming the skin and for that I'm using the Maybelline new baby skin in simple eraser So I'm just gonna take a tiny oh a tiny bit meanwhile She like put so much on her finger and then I'm just gonna be putting this sort of like in my t-zone And then I'm going in with the Flormar Radiant Pink Skin Highlighter. And I'm just going to be putting this sort of like on the highest point of my face. Okay, so I've got three shades of the Rimmel London Lasting Finish 25 Hour Foundation. So I've got the shade Toast and honey i feel like toast might suit me a bit better because it's got a yellow undertone whereas this is very warm so i'm gonna go in with toast and then see how that looks on the skin and to blend that in i'm using my real technique sponge so this is a very like in my opinion this is quite a full coverage foundation Okay, so first the impressions on this foundation. First of all, it is a bit too warm for me. I don't know if you can tell on camera. Um, but I actually like it. Like the coverage is very, very nice. Like this is a very full coverage. It's covered every, any like dark spots that I may have. Okay, so I'm just going to be going in with a concealer quickly. And I don't have a concealer that's actually from Zando. So I'm just going to go in with my regular concealer. To bronze up my face a bit, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Master Bronze Color and Highlighting Kit. And I'm going to go in with the two middle shades. I love this product. I use this product every single day like I feel like it's so affordable but it's so so good like taking it down my neck so I can also just blend it in um, everything can match and then for blush I'm going in with the Maybelline master blush contour and highlight highlighting kit and I'm going in with this pinky shade over here So I'm going to just set my under eyes and the areas that I highlighted with a um, press powder. Okay, so next up I have to just do my brows quickly and I've got quite a few brow products here that I want to use for this video and I don't know which one I want to actually use. Okay, so I've got some Rimmel London products over here but I've also got this um, Revlon brow pencil that I haven't used before so I think I'm gonna do like a mixture of these to see like how it's gonna work um, firstly I'm gonna go in with this Revlon pencil and I'm gonna take the spoolie and just brush through my brow hair I'm gonna try this out as well this is the Rimmel London brow this way three in one ultra soft powder i've never ever used this oh my word i'm so nervous and then i'm just going in with that spoolie just to sort of brush the product through the brow hair Oh 
so what I'm going to do now is clean up my brows just so I can get a nice shape it's because this is a powder brow product um, I don't want my eyebrows to look very like powdery so I'm just going to clean up under the bottom of the brow and then to set my brows I'm going in with the Rimmel London Brow This Way Styling Gel for the eyes and today I'm using the Yardley London Mono Eyeshadow in Stealth and this is a single eyeshadow I'm just going to place this all over the eyes then next up I'm taking the Mono Eyeshadow in EOS and putting that into the crease unfortunately I cracked this one so I have to be so careful with it So I'm going back in with that Master Bronze palette and I'm using the two middle shades again and I'm just going to place that into the crease as well. Next I'm going in with the Yardley London Quad Eyeshadow in Wanderlust, the two dark brown shades over here and I'm just going to be placing that on the outer corners of the eyelid. And then in the next eyeshadow, uh, quad eyeshadow, I've got Foxtail Lily and I'm going to go in with this chocolate brown shade over here. And again, just placing that on the outer corner. Alright, so now that you are closer, so you can see exactly what I'm going to be doing on my eyes. Um, I'm going in with these two shades from Revlon. This is the... Revlon Color Stay Cream Eyeshadows and I've got 710 and 730. So I'm just going to take that on my finger. This is number 710. And I'm just going to place this on the eyelid. And then I'm taking 730 and I'm going to apply that right on top of it. And these actually come with a brush, which is quite cool. Um, let's see how the brush actually works. Then I'm going back in with that Master Bronze Contour and Highlighting Palette. Highlighting, highlighting. <laughs> and I'm going to be taking the gold shade over here. And I'm just going to place that right on top of the lid. Alright, so now we're going to move on to eyeliner and I've got three eyeliners over here from Rimmel London. I've got the Scandal Eyes Precision Micro Eyeliner, I've got the Color Precise Eyeliner and then the Scandal Eyes Bold. So I think I'm going to go in with the Precision Micro one. Alright, so for the mascara, I'm going to go in with the Maybelline one. It doesn't really have that much of an impact though because I'm going to be wearing false lashes. So, And what I like to do when I'm applying mascara, I like to hold my mirror underneath over here, like for my eyes, so that when I'm looking down, it actually pushes the lashes up. Okay, so now that the lashes are on, I'm just going to sort of um, darken up the bottom lash line. And for that, I'm going to be using that shade EOS again from Yardley London and just going to smoke up that bottom lash line.
Up next, I'm going in with that Revlon Cream Eyeshadow in 730 again. And I'm just going to take the brush that it comes with and apply it just in the inner corner of the eye. So what this is going to do is really just open up my eye nicely. To highlight, I'm going in with that Master Bronze palette again from Maybelline and I'm using that gold shade to highlight my face. So unfortunately, I don't have a lip pencil from Zando. So I'm just going to go in with one of my other, hi my other highlighters, my other lip liners and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that the lips are lined, I'm going in with the Rimmel London um, Lasting Finish by Kate Lipstick and this is in 55 My New. And to finish off the lips, I'm going in with the Maybelline Vivid Hot Lacquer and this is in the shade Unreal. Such a pretty lip gloss, really. So to finish off, I'm just going to spray some setting spray and I'll be right back. So there you have it guys, this is the end of my video. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video filled with a lot of goodies that you can get off of Zando. I really enjoyed creating this video, testing out the Rimmel London products, Yardley London, Flormar and some Maybelline products. Um, I have done a video similar to this on my channel before but not a lot of those products you could get off of Zando. So, yeah, um, I like this makeup look. My lips are big. Like, don't you guys think my lips are big? Um, so yeah, guys, overall, I really enjoyed this makeup look and I hope you did as well. And you can find all of these products on Zando. That's it from me. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hey! <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Pretend, suspend, read me like a fable